Okay, I used to get put down in the press a lot for my silly fills, as we like to call them. And that mainly came about because I'm a left-handed, right-handed drummer. That means I'm left-handed, but the kit's set up for a right-handed drummer. So if I come off the high hat and the snare, if I'm doing something like this... Any ordinary drummer would come off with the right hand, so he'd go... See, I can't do it to this day. So if I want to come off, I have to come off with the left hand, which means I have to miss a, you know, a minuscule of a beat somewhere, so I go... So that's how that came about, because I just can't play right hand. Like, I can go around the kit from the floor tom to the top toms, which are on the bass drum, easy. But I can't go the other way, because the left hand has to keep coming in underneath the right one. So it would sound something like this. <laughs> which is very awkward for me, because I'm, it's like crossing your hands playing the piano or something. I don't know, but I have to fetch the left stick under the right stick to get to the right tom-tom, if you can figure this out, folks, <laughs> before I then hit with the right hand. So then I, but my style turned into the so-called funny fills, because it would be... that's a major demonstration of my drum work.